I start boiling the gabi and the tamarind together and after that later on I'll smash it to ex it's delicious <laughs> because it was really hard now the most important ingredient but don't chop it finely because it should be just the onions the size of uh, the onion you cut it into four So now you don't have to stir them too much. Smell, guys, it's really uh, mouth watch again. That's the reason why I'm cooking this now. And I'm gonna smell using a fork. And uh, it's easy. And again. Oh my god, I'm extra hungry today. Oh yes, smash. So now I'm adding the tamarind. Oh, look at this. Look. This is, you just need to extract the juice out of it. Because it might get super salty if you add too much. I'll go and stir it. Oh, I saw that it's essential, so I gotta add a little bit, you know. Before. A healthy version of Sinigang, guys. I'm not using any preservative, the tomatoes, the lemongrass, everything is natural. And I'll get back to it to check the green chili and the onion spring. Come on, for them. If you notice, I did not mix anything at all. I got the Sinigan Saulong nut salmon here in front. Oh my God! Oh. Oh my God! Because it's so so soft. And Maui boy, this is man. Thing is such a perfect combination here. Teeth ah. are clean. I think he always brushes teeth. <laughs> this is the eye here. Come, come, my boy. Here later. All right. So let's start. Sorry for the noises, guys. Of tomatoes, you know. And this is the fish, the kangkong. The fish. The fish is so tender. Tower guys, trust me. And I'm eating a little bit of. You're gonna watch out for the bones. And the green chili. But yeast in there, it's adding a perfect taste to it. Oh man, sour food, you Man, the head is so meaty actually. Sinigat, like fish sinigat. I see they use the. So, the meat is. for him so it's not gonna be so sour and now wow salmon